Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. I am Starco Gaming and we are back with another Dragon Champion video. If you are level 15 or below, make sure to use the promo code Starco for a free starter pack. To do so, it is very simple. Uh, you go in the settings, use promo code, then you enter the code Starco, S-T-A-R-K-O, you press OK. And you will receive your free pack thanks to Starco Gaming and the team at Dragon Champion. So enjoy the goodies guys so today guys is going to be jumping into another gear 12 challenge with my tail my tail is actually it really hard on that tier 12 challenge so we're going to show you guys how to actually accomplish it and also guys uh before i forget uh we are starting this week this saturday night 7 p.m pacific time uh weekly giveaway we're going to be giving away four prize of 500 direct coins every single week uh, at least until they pull out the funding uh <laughs> So we're going to be doing that every single week, guys. So make sure to check my YouTube page uh, to have the link to the live stream to set your reminder because that is going to be awesome. We're also are going to have awesome gameplay, awesome awesome tips that we're going to be sharing. So all of that. And also, guys, make sure to hit the like on this video to um, show you support the channel and help promote this video so uh let's jump into what we talk we're going to do here which is a gear 12 challenge on night tail here so let's select night tail let's pick the the little icon here the swore icon and let's go in challenges and let's see uh, how this is gonna work i already tested the first one obviously we have the team set up for this one i already tested the second one too i have the team set up just gonna beat it otherwise i will not have access to this uh, ui so we're gonna be jumping into this one first uh we're gonna select the team we're gonna be using which is this team this is the team we're gonna be using this thing is very very simple guys all you gotta do is enter the fight obviously if you have less hp or less build than me uh, you might actually struggle a little bit more but those gear 12 challenges made for characters who has gear 11.5 already so uh, you have to keep that in mind so the first thing we want to do here is okay we're gonna attack we're gonna attack again then as soon as buff get ready we're gonna use is third skill i'm gonna use it on titania to get the talent and then we're gonna press the auto button and that's gonna be over pretty much and that is all you got you got to do here which is actually pretty simple to be honest unless uh, titania dies too fast that's also a possibility but she is doing fine so far now she is dead obviously that was expected uh, buff is kind of getting screwed here a little bit so that's not helping we never put a blind on her so i actually have to restart that because of this but that is a perfect example of uh, bad rng pretty much just the wrong characters getting ability block and that actually keeps you from applying the debuff and that's that was just a bad uh, a bad showing so we're gonna that actually shows you what can happen too with rng which i think it is an awesome part of those video on this channel obviously so let's do that again because <laughs> personally when i did that strategy earlier i just wreck her that's actually pretty easy but i did apply the blind on her i think that might actually uh, affect things a little bit with how it's gonna go you can also play it manually to have a better you know a better chance at controlling but it's just so so and you play manually and when you can actually do it on autoplay why not get it done on autoplay auto titania does not really dodge here even until she has a lot of dodge which definitely sucks and again we did not apply the blind even until we have like 125 percent density on my uh on my boy here uh, my buff here definitely sucks but he did not get hit by the ability block so that is definitely give us giving us a huge advantage we got the blind now so we should be set up uh, we just needed that one turn to actually give us a huge advantage of blind and then now uh, this should be dead unless uh, something really bad happened which i don't see how this go because this is going way uh, this is going well but we never know she might go crazy no she did not go crazy and this mission is not about uh you know finishing it with everybody alive it's about finishing it that's all so even if you have only one characters alive at the end you have one characters that is fine at least you get the win um you know five or one characters left does not change anything it gives you the rewards you need and that is all you need and obviously if you control it manually you can avoid doing the uh 
invisibility from lula when the tank is dead that actually gives you more damage obviously but i didn't feel it was needed now for the challenge number two challenge number two is a little bit more uh, difficult you need to bring a uh, two elf solius and nightel in the one panda so what i did here guys is that i brought solius lead and I brought as the free for all we can actually bring along, I brought Renara because we're gonna be taking a lot of damage and by bringing two healers, if one of the healers dead, uh, well, Renara is gonna be able to res Solius if he dies and if Sol it's Renara die, but you still have Solius to be able to do some healing, spot healing around. So it actually gives you a huge vintage. We're bringing Ember because she is the strongest Spinda. We bring Nightail because we don't have a choice. We are, we are bringing Wonder Lula because Talon is actually banned from this challenge. And then we are bringing Solius as a lead, obviously. So uh, earlier I actually worked pretty great. Uh, so let's see if it's gonna work as good as earlier that would be awesome that would make this video so awesome but this one we're not gonna be playing that on auto play forget that guys you gotta target you gotta use the proper ability and you're gonna call this a win and obviously we have to kill renara first because if we kill nightel or anybody else around renara is gonna arrest that person and we're gonna have to kill that person again so main objective here is to kill renara as fast as as possible and obviously she's gonna get hit by this which is quite annoying but we we, sh we shall be fine we shall be fine you can see they target Salius first with actually pretty great does that mean that renara is not getting killed on her side and now obviously we're gonna deal with all that healing but that is totally fine now somebody died that is fine we're gonna i'm taking a look who's coming next okay so we can actually do this then we can do this here take care of her and now we have the everything is open in front of us which is actually pretty awesome we're gonna put cheat that on him so Vento he gets sniped he's still gonna survive and then we're gonna start uh killing uh Nightail as fast as possible here hopefully we can actually make it happen before this other guy actually uh put some annoying buff on her uh, that will be awesome now they're starting to target marinara which is definitely not optimal but hopefully we're gonna be able to make it out so here we go we need maybe one more hit oh man that was so close but we got the stun on her so that is very very useful one oh my god man they, they're killing me with this now okay so she is dead it is going not that bad now we're gonna kill something else okay so my renara is surviving which is definitely what we need <laughs> oh damn she just died <laughs> but, but we're still doing pretty good next we're gonna try to kill that healer and we're gonna finish with uh death at the end hopefully I'm gonna see how it goes but this is definitely not what i wanted here but we're still gonna get a win we're still gonna get a pretty easy win three characters left so I actually went pretty fast earlier when i did it the renara die on the other side way faster which actually gave me a little advantage but still we pull a pretty decent fight and we actually got it done but this challenge is not that easy guys this is quite challenging you're gonna make sure those characters are gonna be using are as strong as possible do not use a tank because if you use a tank they will have a tank on the other side and you're gonna get annoyed as much as you try to annoy them so that might actually be a game breaker because uh, the night seal will probably murder your tank way faster than you can murder the tank on the other side so that will be a huge disadvantage so do not bring a tank do not bring more doom because the if you bring wonder lula more doom is gonna with the minions is gonna mess you up on what you're trying to kill so you have to be really strategic and you cannot bring buff because buff is banned too so this is my best strategy for this event if you guys use a different strategy please let me know in the comment section it's always nice Nice to talk about the different strategy um and guys that's pretty much all we have for today's video so again guys don't forget we're gonna be streaming every saturday night 7 p.m pacific time with drag queens giveaway four prize of 500 drag queens every single week the event will always be posted on my main youtube page which uh, if you're watching that on facebook better guys the link is in the description of the video so guys thank you all for watching you all keep enjoying playing dragon champion and i will see you guys again in the next video thank you